come back. Hapum. That's how you need to practice to learn. Understanding the movement when you come in push, kick, hapum, back, hapum, back, the line of the hand when you grab must boom, boom, changing the body here, boom. And the body coming in to work with him. How you move your body in the way that you move in a realistic way is all about you. Can you really do in the movement when the pressure hit you? Why are you using certain move? For back the hand when you come in with that, it creates more power because you more control. Let me show that again. The line up when you come in to push and then you kick, learning that you don't need to go to here. You can go straight to the knee here. Soon that coming in, this hand coming in. Because this hand coming in, you go straight from here, that will turn the job. Soon it turns out away, this hand in here, must into the elbow. If you go like this here, that will land on your face. You need to understand this basic principle. In our training, have to be illustrate and show you through this. Otherwise, you're thinking it's a joke. Maybe you train with somebody else's, and they're thinking it's a joke. That's why you're not serious when it happened. So when that coming in here, you're understanding that. Why are you using that? Because it's the ways. Mm. It's the ways. Closing, understanding the gap here. Learning that already, changing the hand here, hand in the neck here. When that come in the shoulder, land closer into the arm here. So when you come down, it's more easier for you to take him and break his neck. Whatever you do, when you practice, need to understand is when you do it in the real situation, need Wipe him out straight away. Oh, 